what's your thoughts going on to that? I mean, always a good point when you're 2-0 down, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. It's show good character at end. Um, West Bromden. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. I thought game management at first half at 0-0 with two minutes left at first half. We gifted them that goal, really. I don't, I'm don't. i not going to comment whether it were a free kick or not because, you know, where I was stood at, it looked like he contacted him, but it didn't look like enough for a free kick. But end of the day, you've got to be aware and focused enough to switch on for a free kick. Yeah. It's a free header. There's nobody even jumping up with him. He'll probably win the easiest goals he'll ever score, that Williams. And then going into half-time, 1-0, it's a totally different game. I'm thinking, well, if they get a second, it's game over. And obviously they did. Another free header. But that's from a corner. Yeah. Two, yeah, two set pieces. And it's just looped over. There's nobody at back post and it's just poor marking again. Um, but, I, but I'm telling you, first half, I thought we were better side, but we, we were a goal down. Yeah. We had some great chances, Keeper made some good saves. Is that what it's taking, though, together as actually playing? to go Because it was the same at Huddersfield oh, last 10, wasn't it? Yeah, pressure's off the win, it. Yeah. They can express themselves a bit more. I thought subs made a difference. I thought Thomas and Simoes did well when they came on. I don't know why he announced Clark Adore. I've, I've just said to Craig in his interview, he said Clark Adore. We were like, oh, all right then. But I thought it was Simoes. Did really well for that equaliser, yeah. didn't Well, it? yeah, to be fair, what I did like is we kept going. The yeah. last 10 minutes, we were, we were stronger side. Well, the one thing that did concern me is physicality. We were getting pushed off ball so easy at times. I think that's something that we need to be better at, is getting stuck in. There are a lot of tackles that were 50-50 we were backing out of them. But then when Thomas came on, Dan, he, he was jumping in like a madman. Yeah. But that's what you need when you're down bottom. You need to fight for your life. You need every point possible. Um, that could change a lot of things, that, going into Stoke next week. Um, a point's obviously better than note, going against a team that's in top six. So... You reckon to sat the board chance? You know what I think. <laughs> totally agree with it. We weren't for long enough. Um, but end of the day, I get behind players and I was getting behind players at 2 0. You know, there were a bit of me thinking they need to. You know, there's one thing I'm going to say that Murray made comments about saying that I wish people stopped saying that players are naive. Well, them two goals were naivety. Yeah. Both switching off, two important times at game, we've switched off, that's naive. Yeah. It's not, not to do with quality. Well, it is to do with quality. It's naivety, though, first and foremost. But we reacted well. 2 0 down, come back to 2 2. It reminded me a bit of Derby, where we finished stronger. But we take us chances, look. Or we don't give them two yeah, goals. We could have won that. We could have won that, yeah. Because we, we, I didn't think they did anything else. They looked threatening at times in the second half, but they were in control of the game. They were better in the second half, I thought they were, well, but I, I didn't think they were much going forward. Yeah. Again, it, we're causing his own issues again. We're his own worst enemy all the time, you know that as much as I do. Yeah, yeah. Um, at times we played some really good stuff and, you know, it just makes you feel a bit unlucky that we didn't come out of that. Yeah, it's when we play with pace and purpose, we get ball out of his feet and have a lot more urgency. We look a lot better. When we're dawdling on ball, I think we're, we're thinking too much. Yeah. With the, there's times we're not taking a lot of responsibility. We're, we're letting somebody else do a job rather than you, I think. Yeah. We need to just do it and gamble and do it. There were a moment at back post where you, everybody went nuts with you. I think Sibic and Brown or Sibic and Cavari, they both left it for each other. Or Simoes and Sibic left it for each other. Yeah. Take a bit of responsibility and go for it. But we've had chances there to win it. Chances there to win it, believe it or not. 2-0 down. Yeah. But well, like, majority of folk, folk, uh, uh, neutrals have watched it on Sky, so you've seen, seen performance there. <laughs> We haven't got a problem going forward. We look threatening going forward. Yeah. We need to have more clinic. Well, again, it's down to quality. We need to be more clinical in front of goal. If, if we finish them chances, like every week I keep saying it, we, we you know we do more. Yeah. But then defensively as well, we're so leaky. Yeah. Every time one ball through the channel and they were in. So we need to sort that out as quick as possible. I mean, I want somebody in now. I like Murray and I think he's doing well. But we need somebody for long term. Yeah. Um, they've, had, they've had nearly a month now. Let's sort it out. Let's get somebody in. You know, um, but well, well Stendhal's back in, isn't it? Would you have him? Well, yeah, I, I wouldn't let him go in first place, but I don't think it'll happen. If if, they, if it does, <laughs> God, God Almighty, they'll, they'll look they'll look silly, they ain't they? If they reappoint him, they'll look more than silly. But I think we we played a lot better than Rusfield. We need to be doing that against teams around us. We need to be doing that next week from off for ninety minutes. We can't be doing it for twenty minutes and then fifteen minutes fading off. We need to be doing it for ninety minutes. Stoke will be coming here. If they lose at West Brom, I don't know if I don't know if we've gone above them now, but well, it's at Stoke. It's at Stoke. Well, so I, think, I still think West Brom will win. I well, I hope they do as a favour anyway. But look, they're coming here next week. Stoke has still got some quality players, but we can take heart from our performance today. We've got a few more days to fo to prepare, a few more days to rest. Let's get in at them a 90-minute performance, and let's go for it. Um, but I'm proud of them tonight. You know, like like Steve says, when they play well, I'll praise them. And when we play poor. 
That's how we've played for us. As simple as that. But well done, lads, tonight. Show good character. And I hope I hope they're really up here after that because, you know... They as, deserve it, don't they? Yeah. It, it could be another... It could be a turning point, that. Fingers crossed, you know, I'm praying that it could be. But well done. Well done for the comeback, lads.